Hi, Miss Miller. My name's Courtney. I'm going to be your home health nurse. How are you doing today? I'm okay. Okay. Well, the doctor's called me here because um, he wants me to take a look at your wound, okay? So I'm just going to lean over. Can you lift up your gown for me? Okay. Oh, it's sore. Oh, I see. Okay. And uh, it's kind of got some gunk on it. It's getting on my clothes. Okay. Well, you can sit back down. I'm just going to call the doctor really quick, okay? Okay. It hurts. Hello, Dr. Jones. Yes, this is Courtney, the home health nurse for Miss Miller. Well, I just took a look at her wound and it looks, it's very red and there's some edema and it appears to be separating and I even see some ser um, serous fluid. What would you like for me to do? Okay, I can do that. Thank you. Okay, I just, um, the Dr. Jones just said he wants me to draw some labs um, for you, so I'm going to draw a CMP and a CBC. Is that okay? You mean like uh, stick me with yes, the needle? Yeah, I'm just going to stick you. It's not a very big needle, just so I can draw some blood, okay? I'm hard stick. That's okay. I'm pretty good at this. Are you really? I am. I might look young, but trust me, I've got a lot of years experience, okay? Alright, so I'm just going to need you to hold on to this and squeeze it really tight for me. Okay, I'm just going to put this blue rubber band on your arm, okay? I'm kind of nervous. I got it. Um, is it going to bleed all over the place? No, it's not going to bleed all over the place, I promise, okay? Harding University Operator. Hello? Miss Miller? Miss Miller? Hello? This is the doctor's office? Uh, yes. Uh, we need you to come in. Some of the labs that uh, Courtney drew the other day um, came back abnormal, so we need you to come in. Can you come in tomorrow at 10? I can come in on Tuesday. I can't, I can't come tomorrow. It has to be Tuesday. I can't get a ride until Tuesday. We can do Tuesday. Okay. Tuesday, next Tuesday at 10 a.m. Okay, I'll be there. I'll be there. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'll, at 10 o'clock Tuesday at the doctor's. Okay, bye bye. Bet I got cancer. Yeah. Hey, how are you doing? I'm okay. Well, before uh, the PA sees you, she wants me to draw some labs. I'm going to draw a CBC and a, um, a CMP. So if you can take your jacket off real quick, I will, um, I'll start that. You know, that I think they think I've got cancer. Cancer? Oh, really? Well, I don't know. We'll just have to see. Oh, I'm so worried. Oh, honey, it's going to be okay. I don't know. All right. Just get I you think cool. I got. Are you good at this? I'm really good at this. I'm, I'm the best. And you got a nice vein there. Yeah, you can see through my skin pretty good. All right. I'm nervous. Um, Hello. Hi, Miss Miller. This is Dr. Jones. Yes, this is Miss Miller. How are you doing today? I'm okay. I'm Christina. I'm the PA. Oh, okay. What's a PA? Physician assistant. So I work under the supervision of your doctor. So I'm going to see you today. And your lab results have I've never shown. Never had a girl doctor. I'm not a doctor. I'm a physician assistant. I'm a PA. Okay. Yeah. So on repeat lab results here, we have a blood glucose of 180, and your hemoglobin A1C is 7.8 percent. I don't have okay. cancer. Is that my cancer? Is that well? That might be a totally separate issue. The lab check, I believe, drew some of your blood, so we're gonna have to wait to see what those results are. Okay, but um, I don't know what all that is. A yeah. A1C. So what it is is you have type two diabetes mellitus. Okay, we're gonna need to give you medication to treat that. Mm hmm. What is is that like? Sugar? High sugar? Yes. So you're going to need to take the medication we're going to give you two times a day, okay? And I'm also going to ask that you watch your sugars and your simple carbohydrates. And you're going to need to add 40 to 60 grams of complex carbohydrates every meal. And we'll give you a sheet on that. 
Um, I don't know. Okay. 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 So the pills that we're going to give you will be for two times a day and I'll write you a prescription and it's going to be for a glucose monitor. You'll take that to the pharmacist and they'll show you how to use that and where to find it. Okay. A monitor like a heart monitor at the hospital that they put on my chest. It's not, not quite like that. You won't be wearing it on you, but you're going to use it to be checking your sugars and the pharmacist will show you how to use that. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. So, oh, okay. Yeah. Is there a wound we need to look at? Here? Yeah, I got one in my right hip and it's, oh, it's got gunk coming out of it. Okay. Let me and take it's, a look. And here. it stinks really bad. Yeah. You're going to need to follow up with the orthopedic surgeon on that. Okay. Good grief. All right. And we'll see you back here in the clinic in one month to follow up. It has on your to be on a Tuesday. I can't get a ride up here except on Tuesdays. Okay. Well, we can we can see if we can work that out with our staff and get your appointment on Tuesday if that's what works best for you. It is. It is. Because okay. uh, my and my daughter can't get off work except on Tuesdays. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So. We'll try to work that out then. Uh, do you have any questions? Did you say I got sugar diabetes? That's right, yeah. And we'll give you a pamphlet on that. The pharmacist will show you how to use the monitor, and then we'll follow up with you in a month. We'll try to get that appointment on a Tuesday, okay? Okay. All right. Well, and you I got to get a monitor. That's right. So you take the prescription I'll give you to the pharmacist. They'll know the monitor, and they'll show you how to use it. Prescription mm -hmm. for a monitor? That's correct. It's a little, it's a little odd, okay. but it'll come together. And don't forget that medication is for twice a day. Okay. Okay. Right. Twice a day. Yeah. All right. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. Well, you have a great day, Mrs. Miller. We'll see you soon. Okay. Thank you. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. I'm Debbie Miller. Okay. Date of birth? 5-18-55. And you are Debbie Miller? I am. Okay. Is this a new prescription for you? Yes. Uh, they told me to pick up uh, a prescription here at the doctor's office, a PA lady. Okay. Okay. Well, this prescription, this is for your diabetes. Did you just recently get diagnosed? They had I said I had high sugar. Okay. Yeah. That's what this is going to be used for. This packet right here is going to tell you all the information that you need to know about it. So you just take this packet home and you read about it in your own time. You're going to take one tablet twice a day. One tablet twice a day? Yes, ma'am. Is that what okay. they told you at the doctor? Oh, I thought they told me to take two, uh, two a day. Okay. Well, one tablet in the morning, one tablet at night. They've also given you a blood glucose monitor. Uh, so. A blood glucose monitor? Yes, ma'am. So you're going to have to check your blood glucose. So you have test strips and you have lancets and you have a blood glucose monitor. You're going to prick your finger with these lancets. You're going to put the test strips in the monitor and that's how you're going to check your blood glucose. This book right here is going to give you all the information that you need to know about the blood glucose monitor. You've seen one of these before, haven't you? Not really. No, they had a big one at the hospital. Okay. Well, the only one I've ever seen is the one at the hospital. Well, these are real simple to use. Just put that test strip in here, prick your finger with this lancet, read about it in that book, prick and you'll. Finger? Yes, ma'am. You mean stick a hole in it? Yes, ma'am. You gotta prick your finger to get the blood glucose. I don't know if I can do that. It doesn't hurt. It's just a little prick. Oh, okay. You have any questions? Well. I guess I can read that. Yeah, just read about it. Read about your medicine, read about that book, and you'll be good to go. Do you need me to write a check for it? That'll be great. It'll be $35. Okay. That's a lot. Okay. Okay. Thank you. You have a nice day. I'll give you my check. Thank you.
you put this? I don't know. Hey, Miss Miller, how are you? I'm pretty good. Okay, well, I'm just coming to do a follow-up check on you. Um, how's your diet been going? I, I guess it's uh, doing okay. Um, I'm trying to uh, watch those carbohydrates. and uh, Carbohydrates? Uh, yeah. Um, I think she told me... I was supposed to limit my number, and mm -hmm. this whole bag of donuts, it says 29 grams, so I think I'm staying in it okay. Okay. Uh, okay. And uh, I'm doing some kind of, uh, I'm taking uh, those pills twice a day, it, but they are terrible. I'm glad I only got a couple more days left because I'm having the diarrhea. I can't hardly stand it. Those okay. pills are making my stomach just, oh awful. Yeah. Those uh, sugar diabetes pills that mm -hmm. they have me yes. taking mm -hmm. and uh, I just don't, uh, uh, I, I don't, they're making my stomach just have diarrhea all okay. the time. I just have diarrhea all the time. I don't like sticking myself. Okay, how has that been going? Well, how often are you testing yourself? Um, well, I try to do it, I try to get up enough nerve to do it at least once a day. Okay. And uh, I have a hard time sticking myself. Mm -hmm. uh, kind of hurts. How's your wound looking? I know I checked it uh, not uh, that long ago. I, th I think it's uh, it's getting a little better. Okay. But um, it's still not well. Okay. And I'm still having quite a bit of pain. Okay. Uh, have you been able to exercise any? Well, I can't. No, I'm not really exercising. Okay. I'd, uh, I, I just, it's all I can do to just take care of getting, mm -hmm. sitting here and getting something to eat. And okay. I'm not doing much exercise. I, I watched some TV exercise shows and I tried to, I couldn't do those exercises on the TV. Okay. Uh, uh, they had balls that they were rolling on and mm -hmm. I can't do that. Okay. I, I can't do those kind of exercises, but uh, anyway, I, I, I'm I'm making it okay, you know. I'm by myself, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, my daughter comes by and she takes me to the doctor sometimes mm -hmm. when she can and brings me my food. Mm -hmm. We go up to the Dollar General and get something to eat, but uh, uh, I'm doing okay. Hi, Ms. Miller. I'm the PT. Um, now, today is what we're going to do is we're going to do the evaluation so we can get uh, our OASIS information for Medicare, and uh, then I'm going to test your balance doing the Tenetti, and then I'm going to show you some home exercises because a lot of times it's what we'll see with uh, after a surgery and you have that edema in there, you get some inhibition of the quadriceps and they start shutting down. So I want to give you some exercises for that, um, but we need to get some balance information first. So let's start with that. So um, I'm going to put your walker right here. Let me just have you go ahead and stand up, please. Okay. All right, now if you stand there, can you let go of the walker? Mm-hmm. Okay. Like that? Yeah. Now, um, just put your hands down at your side for me. Okay. Okay. Now, can you close your eyes? All right, open them back up. Okay. Now, hands still down at your side. I'm going to give you a little push on your chest. Oh, okay. All right. Now, I want you to turn in a circle for me. Like with the walker? No, leave the walker right there. You just kind of kind of just turn in a little circle. Like like this? Yeah, that'll well, work. Can I have my eyes open? Yeah, you can have your eyes open. Okay. I should have told you that, huh? Okay. Okay. All right. Go ahead and sit back down for me, please, ma'am. Okay. Perfect. 
You all right with that? Yeah. Okay, so now here's your home program that I'm going to give you. All right, you've got your little band, all right, with that. I saw that on TV. Yeah, this one's better though because it's from a medical place, all right? Okay. That's why we can charge more for it. Okay. Okay, so here's your exercises. You're going to do your long arc quads, your short arc quads, your quad sets, your glute sets, and your ham curls. I want you to do those twice a day, three sets of ten. Okay? Now, I'm going to let you, you can just read through there, pretty easy. Make sure when you use the band that you put it on a piece of furniture that's sturdy or you can pull the piece of furniture over. Okay? Now, me or the PTA will be coming out three times a week to do your exercises. Okay? PTA, physical therapy assistant. They're like me, just not as good. Okay? Um, so sometimes they'll come out, sometimes I'll come out. Um, but uh, we'll do your exercises, we'll get you walking, and uh, then we'll get you where you can be on your own. Do you have any questions? Um, so I should just follow these instructions? Yes, ma'am. Just read these and, and do them? Yeah, do they're, have, they're pretty easy. Do you have a video? Um, no, we don't have any videos. I like videos. Okay, okay. I'm not... Um, Okay. So how, how often am I supposed to do this? Twice a day. Three sets of ten each exercise. Three sets of ten. Three. How many exercises are there? There's about five exercises that you'll need to do. It's really not that hard. I have a lot of older people that can do a lot more, so I think you'll, you'll be able to do it. Once you get into it, you'll learn to love it. Really? Okay. Yeah. Okay. I, I, I need to get Trust better. Trust me. Have I ever lied to you before? No. Okay. I, I, got to, I got to get better so I can get out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. we got to get you to the Walmart. Yep. Yep, you do. Any questions for me? Uh, I don't know. I think I'm. I think I can follow this. Okay. Let me look at this. Yeah, I just. Okay. I think I can do it. Okay, great. So either the PTA or I will call you, and we'll be back in a couple of days, and we'll get you rolling. Okay. 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 Great. We'll see you. Okay.